We do almost all of our surgeries these days in an office-based operating environment, and I love that because it gives us great control over all of these procedures. And one of the procedures that we do a lot of is cataract surgery with the implantation of a toric lens. And when you're putting a toric lens in the eye, of course, the orientation, the alignment of that lens is critical. The way that we used to try to align these lenses is we would have the patient sit upright and I would mark the surface of the cornea using a marking pen with the patient's eyelid held open with my fingers. And that was not fun. That wasn't a great way to mark the eye. And the reason was is because it's tough when you're just eyeballing the eye and trying to put the mark precisely at six o'clock or use a bubble leveler and try to line it up on the eye, you end up with these skewed, poorly inked, runny marks on the surface of the eye that give you a poor landmark for where to align the toric lens. There are some practices out there that have really sophisticated, fancy lens alignment technology. Callisto is one great example. But we don't have that at our practice, so we need some other reliable way to mark our patients to align the toric lens. And about two years ago, we shifted to using something which has made our lives a thousand times better. It's an app, and we have no we have no idea who made the app. We have no financial relationship. It's called iPro, and it's this beautiful little app that allows you to take a purple mark and put it anywhere on the limbus. It doesn't have to be at six o'clock or 12 or nine. You just put a purple mark anywhere on the limbus. You photograph the eye and then into the app software, you put the intended axis of the toric lens. And the app will tell you relative to the purple mark that you made anywhere on the eye, how the lens should be aligned. And the reason that this is so great is because it, it eliminates the need to be super precise in marking the eye by hand. You can mark it anywhere and you can get really accurate results even if you're not a physician. So the way that we do this is we have our PA, Emma Scott, she marks the eye for the implantation of the toric lens. And she has recorded a little video, which we're gonna show now, that describes how she does it. And since we started doing it this way, our results have been much better in terms of the alignment of the lens being a lot more accurate and it turns out that the surgeries are faster because rather than me having to do everything by, by hand myself, we're allowed to have this component of the procedure done at a super high level by somebody else. And to have Emma lend her special ability here has made our practice so much better and more efficient. So here is her video showing exactly how she does it, and we hope it might be useful to you in your practice. My name is Emma Scott. I'm a physician assistant here at Parker Cornea, and today I'm going to be showing you how I mark the eye for our cataract surgery using a toric lens. The very first thing that we're doing here is as soon as the patient is brought into the OR, we're going to use a marking pin and we'll make a random mark on the eye at the limbus. This can be done at any point, it does not matter. Next, we're using this app called iPro and we're able to move this little um, purple mark to the location where we put the actual mark on the eye and this is what it, the display looks like. Next, in the lower left corner where it says T-I-O-L axis, you're going to enter the desired axis for your lens. And then up in the upper right corner, you can see it will shoot out a number. And this number is telling us exactly how we need to mark the eye in relation to the purple mark that we put in order for us to achieve the desired axis. So here we're getting the number minus 49 counterclockwise, which is perfect. So we're going to mark the eye at 49 for this patient. If this number though is positive, then we are going to subtract it from 180. And that number is what we will use for the mark. Next, I'm just drying the eye with a couple wex. I want the surface to be as dry as possible before I make the mark just for it to stay better. Then I'm using this instrument called a Mendez ring and you can see it's a little blurry, but right at the zero slash 180 point, I'm lining that up with the purple mark that we previously made. 
And then this is a different I, so it's gonna be a different axis. And But based on that 0, 180, I'm going to line up the two ends of this toric marker to the desired axis from the app that we got and stamp it, making sure that the center of that instrument, the center metal ring is lined up in the center of the cornea. And this is just able to speed up Dr. Jack and Dr. Parker when they are doing cataract surgery because now they can just sit down, they know exactly where the lens needs to go. Previously, this part of the surgery was done with kind of a level and in leveling instrument, which is not as accurate. This app has really helped us in a, improving our accuracy except putting the toric lens exactly where it needs to go. The toric lenses have to be put at a very specific spot in order to correct for astigmatism. If they're off even the littlest bit, the um, resulting vision is just not going to be near as good as it would be if it's as precise as possible. And so in doing this, it's just speeding up the doctor considerably before he even gets in the room most times. So that is how we mark the eye for our toric cataract surgeries. Thank you so much for watching.